Hey everyone, um, I have a haul for you today. I'm going to start with Dollar Tree. It's mostly Christmas items. Um, I do have also Tuesday morning and there's not too many Christmas items with that one. So let's get started with Dollar Tree. I picked up some ribbon. I got three different ones and I'm probably going to use these to make bows um, for, for some mesh wreath. So I got these three. This one just has the reindeer on it, really pretty. And then this one is that big chunky glitter kind of looking and the ribbon itself is almost like a mesh. So I got two of those. I got one in red and then one in silver. I had found one of these um, in a fall haul that was kind of like an amber orange and that was the only one I found so I was really excited when I saw these in the store. Um, I can't remember if there was any other colors. I think there might have been a gold one as well. So I got that. Um, I have three pocket letter pals. So I thought it would be a cute idea just to get some little gifts for them since this would be a Christmas themed pocket letter. So they had some really cute scarves at Dollar Tree. So I picked one up for each of them. And look at these are adorable. Um, I'll probably tie these around the pocket letter and then they can use it as a scarf if they want to or do crafts with it or whatever they want. They did have quite a few different designs of these um, but this one I thought kind of like was the most traditional Christmas colors but didn't really have any sort of Christmas designs on it. So I think if you wanted to you could wear this all year hopefully um let's see i did pick up some more bubble mailers um starting to get the larger ones now instead of the smaller ones um the pocket letters are just so fat when you fold them up especially if you have a lot of goodies and then like extra stuff in there so i started to get the bigger ones so that there's some more room in there and then the last thing from the Dollar Tree I picked up, um, it's a Christmas themed card game and they did have several different ones. This is just a matching game. They had crazy eights. I don't know. They had probably three or four different ones, maybe even more than that. But I'm not going to use these as an actual card game. I just, I wanted to maybe cut out the designs and use them as cutouts in the pocket letter. So I thought that was a really cute idea. Santa Claus, just there's all kinds of stuff, but it's all Christmas themed. So that's what I'm gonna use those for. Um, I did open a couple of different boxes and these actually had the best pictures. Um, some of them just look like regular cards, like playing cards, but I thought these were really cute. So just to do something different, just a different idea I thought it would be cute to cut some of these out and use them. Just kind of almost like making my own die cuts. So that's everything that I've got from the Dollar Tree so far. Uh, I probably will make another trip back um, before Christmas. Um, I've looked at ornaments and I just haven't picked any I apologize. I have another Dollar Tree bag. It was mixed in with my Tuesday morning. Maybe this is the one that has the ornaments in it. Yeah. I bought a bunch of ornaments last year um, for myself, for my own tree. And this year I didn't really see anything that I liked. Not even that I liked. There's quite a few cute ornaments but they just don't really go with my theme. So I found these and I picked these up. I got three of them, one for each of my pocket letter pals. Each one of them says believe. They also had peace and I believe they came in silver as well as gold. But I thought these were really pretty and would just be really cute to include in with a pocket letter so that they could use that as an ornament if they wanted or, I mean, you could even, 
attach this to a wreath. That would be really pretty. And then I got this whole thing of bows. These are like the velvety bows. They just twist tie on. I'll probably send a couple of these in the pocket letters as goodies. Um, but I will probably make some sort of Christmas gift DIY for my coworkers. Um, and I thought that I could use these to go along with that. Okay, that's everything in that bag. And then this bag has this enormous reindeer. Super sparkly. And this is going to go on a wreath. So I have a tutorial on my channel uh, where I finished up that red deco mesh wreath and it has some silver in it. So that's why I'm, I'm choosing. I got this, you know, the silver and red ribbon and then also that reindeer ribbon. It looks just like this reindeer and then it has the silver trim on it as well. So that's all going to go on the wreath. And then there's so much stuff on my desk here. I'm having trouble finding a place to put everything. Um, I got these gift tags. These are just going to be for presents. Um, I may include a sheet in with a pocket letter. I think that would be a nice just kind of gift. I, I always want to have these. I always try to keep them on hand. I feel like I always run out every year and never have enough. So I would love it if somebody just included a sheet of these to and from stickers in a pocket letter for me for Christmas. And I always, always get these from Dollar Tree. I always get these big pads and you have to be careful. This one has 104 tags or whatever you want to say, stickers. Um, they do have another pad there that looks exactly like this, but it doesn't have as many stickers <laughs> in it. So just be careful when you're grabbing it that you get the one that gives you the most tags. They're really cute. There's a lot of different themes. So you get the traditional red and green, but then you also get the blue and white. So depending on whatever your theme happens to be for your packages or whatever color your wrapping paper might be, you have a variety in here. So hopefully it'll match what you have. And then these, I pretty much just got these for Cole to stick on the storm door. He really likes doing stuff like that. And they had so many different designs. Uh, I actually let him pick which ones he wanted. He loves penguins for some reason. He has a penguin stuffed animal that he sleeps with every night. So he really liked these penguins. He thought they were funny. And then we got kind of a traditional, it says Merry and Bright, again, has a penguin, but also has a Santa Claus and a snowman and some candy canes. There's little snowflakes in there. So some candy. That's just something for him just to kind of decorate the house a little bit. That's everything from the Dollar Tree so far. Like I said, I'm probably going to go back and get some more stuff. But I've had so much going on just in the end of November. All right, let's see. That's everything from Dollar Tree. There's glitter everywhere from that reindeer. I heard that you can just take some hairspray and spray that on there to keep the glitter from falling off. I've never actually tried it, so I don't know how well it works, but I have heard that tip quite a few times. All right, I've got everything out of my Tuesday morning bag. Um, there are a couple Christmas themed things in there, so let me just start with those. Uh, I got two packages of these die cuts, all Christmas theme. Show you what's on the back there. So there's Merry Christmas, there's snowflakes, there's a little birdie wearing a snowman hat, there's mittens, there's a gingerbread man, believe, a reindeer. Um, Quite a few Christmas trees, a Santa Claus, presents, a candy cane. There's all kinds of cute stuff in here. I'm trying.
trying to see if it actually tells you how many pieces you get in here. And I don't see anywhere where it says how many pieces are actually in here, but it looks like there's, there's quite a lot. Oh yeah, 55. There's 55 cardstock die cut ephemera bits and pieces and includes foil accents. So I got two of those. And then for our 10 year wedding anniversary was November 6th. So I asked for um, the Cricut Cuddle Bug and I got that for my anniversary, which is awesome. But it only came with one die cut and it's just a thank you die cut. So I specifically wanted to go to Tuesday morning. I feel like they have some okay prices on die cuts or comparable prices to other places, but I feel like you get more of a pack of die cuts for the same price as you would just get one die cut at somewhere else like Hobby Lobby or Michaels. So I picked up this. Now this is a Sizzix, but I, I'm pretty sure that they all work uh, most of the different brands work on the Cricut Cuddle Bug. So this just has a lot of different words and they're all Christmas themed. So I thought that was really cool. I'm planning on making a bunch of these and including them in with the pocket letters. And then this is not Christmas themed, but it's also die cuts that I picked up. Um, I just thought this had a lot of really pretty die cuts and they all seem to be the right size for a pocket letter. Something that would fit kind of into that two and a half by three and a half rectangle. And there's some more on the back. And I like that that kind of had like an H because my last name starts with an H. So $12.99 for this. There, it says 220 plus unique images. So now I'm totally confused because now I don't know if this is something that is not compatible with the cuddle bug, if this is something that has images off of the computer, like digital images. Now I'm totally confused. It says image set includes 108 layered images, 22 images, two layered fonts. So this is a, a pretty big box. There's a bunch of stuff in there. You guys help me out. I've never used this machine. I don't know too much about it. Um, if you can just kind of leave in the comments below and let me know if you think this is something that's compatible or if this is something that goes on the computer and goes more with the high-end crickets, and I need to return this. Let me know. Let me know if, if you have any idea, because I really don't. And then this is something else. Um, previous pocket letter tutorial, I kind of take these apart and just take the individual spiral and thread it through each one of the holes on a pocket letter. So that's kind of the idea I had with these. They had quite a few different ones. I actually had two other ones that I put back when I found this one because this one was kind of a burlap and then it had like that red glitter sparkly edge. So this one was my favorite. I thought it was really, really pretty. And this was $3.99 for both of these. So basically two bucks for each bow. And then this is the last Christmas themed item, but I thought these were really cute. They just look like little snowflakes or like little snowflake pinwheels. $1.99 for six. Really pretty. And I'll include two of those per pocket letter. And then um, Brett, my husband and Cole were with me when I was at Tuesday morning and they picked out these Fox stickers. They really liked the Fox stickers. I ended up getting three just because I figure I'll do a pocket letter uh, theme around these stickers. But they're super cute. 
I love foxes. It says crafty like a fox. How adorable is that? So what a fox. You are so foxy. Hello, gorgeous. Just some really, really pretty stickers. And I thought that would be a really cute theme. So that's everything from Tuesday morning. Um, I only have one store left, but it's Target Dollar Spot, and I have a ton of stuff. So I want to try and go through it kind of quickly because I don't want this video to be too long, but Target has some amazing Christmas stuff. I was so excited when I found these. I did a Christmas in July pocket letter exchange with someone, and she actually sent my pocket letter in one of these. It's like a felt envelope. Never seen these before. That was the first one I've ever seen. And I saw these at Target, and I was so happy to see them. So they're a dollar a piece, super cheap. I was surprised that they weren't three bucks a piece because they're really cute. So it just has a button and then a little like elastic tab. And then you just put things inside, just like a regular envelope. So I did get three different ones and I think they had more designs than that. I think they had maybe five. So I got this one. It has Santa Claus. It says to Santa, the North Pole. And then I got this red one. This one says special delivery to Santa Claus, North Pole. But that one was really cute. This one is my favorite. It's like a charcoal gray. It has the Christmas trees and says Merry Christmas. Christmas trees are my favorite, favorite thing about Christmas. I love going and picking out our Christmas tree every year. I love decorating the Christmas tree. I love the way the Christmas tree smells. I love anything and everything that has any kind of like pine decoration on it. Like I just, Christmas trees to me make me feel like Christmas. And I think it has a lot to do with the smell. The funny thing is though, I will not buy anything that smells like pine, like candles or air freshener. I just don't, I don't care for those, but the fresh Christmas tree and just the sight of Christmas tree stuff, I love it. It makes me, it makes me think of Christmas. That is Christmas for me. And then let's see, what did I get? I got one stamp for each one of my pocket letter pals. Um, again, they had a variety of different designs. I chose Santa Claus. I chose a little fox with a puffball hat. I think that's a fox, yeah and a Christmas tree. This one's my favorite. And if any of you Pocket Letter Pal Girls are watching and you want to claim like your favorite stuff, just comment down below and let me know and I will send you whatever you choose. And if two of you happen to want the same thing, whoever asks me first will get it. <laughs> so just a heads up. Um, I also got some felt shapes. There's 10 in here. Again, different designs of these. I chose the candy canes. And then these wooden shapes. I love anything that's wooden. I, I, don't, I don't know why. I just, I love anything that's wooden. So I got these gingerbread men. They did have different designs for the gingerbread men. And I think there's, I do have some other wooden shape Christmas trees in another bag. And yeah, here they are. So, I'm sorry guys, I haven't been telling you the prices. All of that stuff that I just showed you was a dollar. The envelopes, the stamps, the candy canes, and the gingerbread men, all a dollar. Now, there's 10 gingerbread men in here for a dollar. The Christmas trees, there's 30 in here, it's three dollars. So, it's basically the same price. You're getting 10 for a dollar or 30 for three dollars. Um, I originally had the package of snowflakes that was 30 for $3 in the cart. And then I saw the Christmas trees and I put the snowflakes back and got the Christmas trees. So I don't remember if they had anything else. I'm pretty sure they just had the snowflakes and the Christmas trees that I saw anyway. Um, 
again, girls, if you have a, a preference, here's something coming up. I got three different flavored lip balms. Um, this one is Sugar Cookie. This one is Red Berry. And this one is Mint Chocolate Chip Lip Balm. So I got one for each one of my pals. And I got socks. These were a dollar. I was so surprised that they were only a dollar. I thought they were going to be three dollars easily. These are my favorite. The little reindeer. Super, super cute. I love those. And then I got snowflakes. I thought these would be super cute to wear like on Christmas morning if you have Christmas jammies or whatever. And then I got these that say Merry Christmas. These are probably my second favorite ones. They're just kind of goofy and I like that. I think that's funny. So those are the three that I got, girls, if you want, if you have a preference. I'm pretty sure all three of you are probably going to want the little reindeer. But let me know. Let me know if you want something specific. Um, here's some more wooden shapes. These are snowflakes. These are 15 for $3. So not as good of a deal as the Christmas trees of the gingerbread man. Um, but these are a little bit decorated more. You get the buttons on there. They're all painted. They're all different colors. So I thought those were really cute. I'm going to decorate pocket letters with these as well as include them as goodies. I just thought they were super cute. This was one of the first things I grabbed when I went into the dollar spot. Um, I got some washi tape. I know I got more washi tape, so I'm going to set that aside and try to show you all the washi tape together. They have an abundance of tags. There is, I'm going to say like 15 different designs of tags. There's probably more than that. Uh, I picked up this one that has just a variety. Um, there's six in here, so you get two of each design. I'll show you. There's a little bicycle with a Christmas tree, a Christmas tree, and a Merry Christmas. Now, I also got a matching washi. Let me open it up so you can see it. It says... So it has the bicycle with the Christmas tree in it, and it says Merry and Bright. And it, I just thought that was different and cute, and it has a Christmas tree, which is my favorite thing about Christmas. So I picked that up, and I told you there's a ton of stuff. I can't even get everything out of the bag. So I just want to get all of my washies together for you so that I can show you all of the washies that I got. Um, this one says do not open until Christmas and it's a red foil washi. This one is just a plaid washi. Very Christmassy to me though. Uh, this one is a gold scalloped washi. I love washi that has a different shape to it that isn't just <coughs> excuse me sorry that isn't just a regular tape shape so it's really it's not sparkly it's just like a gold foil which is really kind of classy and pretty I think um oh I got two of those there's another one and then this one is my absolute favorite. You'll see why. It's Christmas trees. It's cut out Christmas trees. And it is glittery. It's green glitter. And I only got one of these. I wish I would have got another one. All right. Um, let's see. Man, I did not realize how many tags that I had. I had no idea. So I have these four count gift tags for a dollar. They say Belize. They have a jingle bell, a working jingle bell. 
I hate when you get a jingle bell and it doesn't jingle. What's the point? <laughs> so I thought those were really cute. They have kind of a, a three-dimensional, they have a plaid background, and then the nice Christmas tree green color, and then a red jingle bell. So I thought those were really cute. Four for a dollar again. Um, I got Santa Clauses. He's got a little poof ball on his hat, which I love. And he's a red foil and then kind of a wood grain. So it's not just white. It's like a wood grain and a red foil. So he is really cute. I like him a lot. It was a dollar for six. And I got these tags. Six for a dollar. Two of each design. So there's three different designs. You get two of each. There's a handmade with love. And then, sorry, handmade for you and made with Christmas love. And these words are actually furry. They're like velvety words. So I thought that was really nice. The heart is as well. Anything that's red is like that velvety. And again, six for a dollar. Um, and then I got these, which are all the same. So you get six. They're all the same. They say, have yourself a merry little Christmas. And then on the back, there's a to and from. These have a plaid ribbon with them. So I thought that was really cute. I thought those are really pretty. So six for a dollar in there. See, I told you I had no idea I got that many tags. Um, a couple more wooden shapes. These are three stars for a dollar. They come with some twine, so I will probably just use those um, as an embellishment and hang them from one of the hole punches on the pocket letter, but I thought those were really cute. <coughs> I apologize for the coughing. I've been sick for like three months. It's ridiculous. All right, and then they had these Christmas tree clothespins. I'm not sure why, but the Christmas trees are black. I don't know why they wouldn't be like a dark green, like a Christmas Christmas green, but they're black. I got them anyway. I, th I think they're super cute, kind of sophisticated looking because they're black, I guess. Um, and they're kind of like a medium-sized clothes pen. They're not the real many, many tiny ones and they're not a regular size. So they're kind of in between. Really cute though. I like those a lot. What did I say? Four for a dollar. I didn't say that. And then I got some stickers. Um, I got Christmas tree puffy stickers. 20 for one dollar. I told you guys I'm obsessed with the Christmas trees and it's not just this year. It's every year. Christmas tree puffy stickers. It looks like there's three different sizes. So you've got like a small, medium, and large. And then some of them have some red trim and some of them have dark green trim. And some of them have some blue trim. And then I got these, which are really, really pretty. There's only nine stickers, but they're kind of the embellished, like 3D looking sticker. So I don't mind paying a dollar for only nine stickers when they're kind of, you know, fancier. Really, really cute. And then the very last thing that I have for you guys for this haul, just some more stickers. There's 13 stickers for a dollar. Some of them, the, the little Christmas tree has like rhinestones on it. There's that bike again with the Christmas tree in it. The Santa Claus. Yeah, the wreath has the rhinestones on it too. So does this. So really cute. All right. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful Christmas if I don't see you before then. Bye.